Hey, everybody. I'm Nancy, and you most of you know me. If you don't, I'm Nancy Lagan. I've been in for 30 years. And all this virtual stuff I had to learn a couple of years back. So I thank all the champions for teaching me all of the virtual parties, the Zooms, the PayPal, all of it. But I love people. And so what if you don't have a party in your book at all? What do you do? Well, this is a suggestion and you can do it in September, early September after Labor Day. Um, it's called a thousand dollar day. And a thousand dollar day is where you're gonna try to sell a thousand dollars in one day and you're gonna make 250 bucks. And you're also, my grandkids are so cute. They're giving me the high five in behind here. They're staying overnight. And um, you're also gonna get free Tupperware because you're the host. So the first thing you do, and I gotta put the old glasses on. Okay, um, you're gonna have a party in your own home. So it can be in your home. It can be in your garage. It can be in the patio. It can be in the driveway. It can be anywhere you want it to be. But we all have friends. We all have family. We all have people that are current and local customers. So that's where I always start because I want to get back to all the people that love me and I love them. And so I set up a party in my home and I like to do it where I have my whole kitchen is filled with all the newest products and I've tried me stations. And so I would have like the chopper and I would have the um, cheese grater and the mincer and the, uh, my granddaughter just made um, shaved ice in the ice shaver. And I would have all these try me stations all over my kitchen. I have a very, very big kitchen. I'd have all the newest Tupperware out in the cookware and absolutely everything you could possibly have that you own, you put out for people to see. The next thing you do is you make a flyer, okay? You have to set a date, which is extremely important with date and time and you make a flyer. And you can put anything you want on this flyer, however you're gonna hold the party. So when I do my flyers, I serve food. I used to cater, love to serve food to people. So I have this from like 10 to seven, and I usually do it a Saturday or a Sunday. Usually Saturday is a better day because people are not working and they will come if they're out shopping or whatever. And so I make the flyer and I also make it a Facebook event. So I put it on my Facebook page as an event and you invite absolutely every single person that you can. You also need to open a party link for yourself so that you can put this in your link, I mean, on your Facebook post and in the event, and you set the party link and you can send that to anybody that is not current. They're gonna be sad they can't come unless they wanna drive in or fly in for your party, but you're going to invite them to do whatever they're going to, you're going to have a scratch and dent table. So you take all your Tupperware that maybe you've used in demos and um, you can take all that Tupperware that you've used and it's kind of scratch, but it's not bad. You, you can sell it. I used to sell it at 25% off and then I'd have the money to buy the new products, the new stuff. And then I would have a cash and carry table. Anything that I had cash and carry, I would put that on the table. I would have the new catalog. So you got to make sure you either go to Pam's if you're local or order your new catalogs right now. So you have plenty of catalogs to pass out with all the products of the discounts and all the new things we have. They have to see a new catalog. Everyone loves a new catalog. Um, also, I have a table with the host gifts and a table with the kit. Now, if you don't have all those things, you can make a flyer and put that on one of the tables and you have the new monthlies. So I would have that all in the flyer. Come see new products, new books, new everything, scratch and dent sale, cash and care. Make it so exciting that they want to come. And then what you do is you um, pass out that flyer to absolutely every single person you know. If you have addresses, you can mail it. I know that um, my manager, Nora, she has done bingo for 25 years. And every single month, she mails out 25 invites to the bingo. She fills the room with 80 to 90 people every month for the last 25 years. And so when you invite people and you contact them and you send them something in the mail, they will come. Also, um, you can type your party link in that letter. I would do that as well. And I can text that party link and that flyer to people. I can email it to people. Um, so you're kind of doing a combination, like Loretta said, of everything that you can do to make this party successful. I also reach out then and call people. So if I was going to have this, I would do it after Labor Day, probably the Saturday after Labor Day. And I would have my new books by then. I'd have the date and the time and I serve food. And so I would have coffee and donuts for breakfast. So if they stopped over in the morning early, um, sometimes I do it really early in the morning before they go to work and I would serve coffee and donuts. For lunch, I'd have a hot dogs or some appetizers maybe. Um, and for dinner, it's not dinner, I'd have appetizers that I've made in Tupperware, in the grill, in the pressure cooker, anything I've used Tupperware to make them. 
and I serve food all day long and see everybody that knows me knows that. So they really come for the food. Some people would stop on their lunch hour when I did this during the week. And so you've got all the pre prerequisite work, but the key is like Loretta said, pick up the phone and call them to remind them that you are having this huge event and you're so excited, you hope they can come. I also challenge them to collect $100 in orders because they can go to my website through that party link. They can look at all the Tupperware, collect $100 in orders, and I have a table of gifts if they show up with $100 in orders or more. Also, um, you got to remember to have fun because when you have fun, you have fun, they have fun, you get them excited, they get excited. It's all like, if I go, oh, I'm going to have a party. I hope you can come. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. I'm having this party at my house and it's, you know, it's September 6th and it's going to be the greatest thing in the world. You got to come. You got to see the new book and get it. Are they going to come? Cause they are excited. Cause you're excited. That's the key is to be excited. Um, one thing I will tell you, if you don't know your new products and you're very new, you can take all the products that you're going to show at your event and you can put your, um, the name of the product, the price of the product, the page of the product, and maybe something about the product on a removable label on the bottom of the product. So if you're helping someone and it's a stop and shop, so you don't want them all to sit down and you're going to stand there and demo like we did hundred years ago. It's a stop and shop, stop in shop, see what you like, get a new book, have something to eat and, you know, place an order. And so I try to make sure I put an order form, a monthly and a book out for everyone. And I have plenty of books to do that. And so you want to do that on the labels on the bottom of your Tupperware so that if you don't know what it is or know how to use it, you can read that. They don't know you're really reading it, but it's a great way for you to memorize and learn every single product. And so I used to do that at all my parties when I was new. So this way you think about it at the end of one day, you're not going to be tired because you have had so much fun meeting the people. Also do a drawing for something. So you have a little sheet, name, address, phone, email. You need to get all their information in case they don't order, in case you never knew who they were and they came in off the streets. Sometimes if I do it in my garage, I put signs all over my neighborhood so everyone can come that I don't even know, but I want their name, address, and phone and email. And so that's a really great way to do that. And then you do a drawing so that you have all their information and you can reach out to them later. Think about it. One day of your life, a thousand dollar minimum. Think about it. Two hundred fifty bucks in your pocket, and you get all that for two hundred dollars of free Tupperware. Who wouldn't want to do it? So you know what? I dare you to try it. I dare you to try it. Pick a date, get the flyer, send it out, get the link, set up your party link, and go have fun. Okay. I hope it's successful. Let me know. I'd like to know.